such as an aluminum trunk lid, roof, and doors paired up to 137 pounds. The styling breaks little ground, the 5 series now resembles a slightly inflated 3 series. The headlights, adaptive LEDs, stretch to touch the twin kidney grille, behind which are aerodynamics enhancing automatic shutters. The side view reveals a familiar upper crease along the body side and a lower character line that kicks up behind the front wheels. At the rear, larger tail lights containing LED elements wrap farther around onto the fenders. An available M Sport package dresses up the exterior. It includes a revised front fascia with larger air intakes, restyled rocker panels, and trapezoidal exhaust outlets that poke out from a lower rear fascia style to suggest a diffuser. Inside, the package brings aluminum pedal trim, an M Sport steering wheel, and optional black leather with blue contrast stitching. A pair of fives. At launch, there will be just two models, the 530i and 540i, either of which can be had with rear or all-wheel drive, which BMW calls X-Drive. The former diesel, hybrid, and V8 variants are all absent from our market at least for now. The 530i replaces the 528i, and, following the pattern established by the 3 Series and the 4 Series, it denotes the arrival of BMW's latest turbocharged 4-cylinder. The 2.0-liter B46 engine here makes the same 248 horsepower and 258 lb-ft of torque as it does in the 330i, versus 240 horsepower and 260 lb-ft for the previous Turbo 4. An 8-speed automatic with standard shift paddles is the sole transmission choice. BMW posits that the 530i will scoot to 60 mph in 6.0 seconds, or 5.